Uh, I'm Mario Minali, I'm a real estate broker for Cassandra Properties. Besides being uh, a great uh, real estate agent, real estate broker, I'm also a talented chef. You always got to have, have a glass of wine, red wine, if possible. <laughs> you got to chop your meat. Cups of uh, stock, it can be vegetable stock, chicken stock, but it can be some chicken stock, you can use the cube. You, you will see in the beginning of the recipe. So, in the pack, put about two tablespoons of extra virgin olive oil, put my chopped onions in there. So, take the onion. Then it's ready to add vegetables. Mm -hmm. Let's get ready for the next step. Okay, well, let's add some salt to the vegetables. Some fresh ground pepper, white pepper. Mm -hmm. See the vegetables that are cooking. They're cooking a little bit. We're not going to cook them that much, otherwise, they'll disappear with the rice. Now we're ready to add the, the rice to it. Three cups of uh, good arborio rice. Arborio rice is uh, Italian rice. Add it to the vegetables. Blend them together. Okay, let's toast the rice with the vegetables. And then we'll add half a cup of white wine. Really nice. Let's uh, we head in uh, the stock. Usually rice works for every cup of rice, two cups of liquid. So if you have three cups of rice, you're probably going to add six, six and a half four cups of uh, liquid. So we have that liquid right here. And it just go about a finger over the top. So here we go, the rice is boiling. Okay. Right. So we lower the flame a little bit. We don't need to boil that hard, we just got to boil slowly. So as you see, we do some liquid, we add some more liquid. Not a finger bowl. Right. Okay. So keep going. In the meantime, we're gonna prep for uh, our next ingredient, which is grated cheese and uh, butter. Okay, so the rice is cooking. As you see, it's the reducing, the liquid is reducing, so the, the rice is absorbing the liquid. It's not cooked yet, it needs a few more minutes. It usually takes about 15 minutes to get this thing down from the beginning and so I need to have the drop more of the liquid. And then after that, season it, salt, pepper, it's missing, and then I'll finish it up. This is enough for you can feed about six people without a problem, six to eight people. It's very sim simple, very easy, very economical. Uh, as you see, it's all natural, it's all fresh vegetables, almost ready. As you see, come in. There we go. As you see, the rice is absorbable liquid. 
Now we're ready to, for the finishing touches, which basically we're gonna add the, the butter. This is about three quarter of a stick of butter and Parmesan cheese, almost a cup of Parmesan cheese. What the butter does, it's combined, you know, uh, in Italian it's called mantecato. I don't know the exact translation in English, but in any event, so that's what we do. Now, don't do this at all. What this process is, is it whips the butter into the rice. I add the cheese and mix it all up. Ready to go, ready? Enjoy it. Buon appetito. See you next time. And I'm here to show you how to. Go back. Go back. Go back. Uh, in the past. Ooh. Ouch. Do it again. It's that one.